it going? Hi, everything good, and you? Yeah, I'm good, I'm good. What are your feelings about Bahrain? It's very good, first time on the track. Um, I'm very excited to drive here. Uh, every race that I've, I've watched about Bahrain, it was very exciting, so... So yes, nice atmosphere, nice weather. I can't wait to drive. This is your first time here? Yes, first time on the track. What about Trident? What's your feeling about the team? Yeah, it will be also my first, uh, let's say, no, my second official test because I did Jerez last season. But uh, I'm feeling very comfortable with all of them. They've been uh, working very hard to make uh, the car as quick as possible. And I've worked myself very hard as well. So, so let's see, now it's the time for the reality. I'm feeling great with the team. I hope they, they feel the same. ambition for, uh, for this year? What are you looking for? I'm looking for um, giving my best in other races. I know that I'm working hard for it and I am uh, preparing myself as much as I can before the races. So, so yes, I think the result will be a consequence of, uh, of all the work that we are doing. So, so yes, we hope that we can achieve uh, good positions, good results and uh, we can hope, I imagine, for a title. Great. Are you preparing like with a special uh, like uh, workout or diet? What, what, what's your lifestyle? I think it's a bit of everything. I, I've been, uh, I'm living in Milan right now, very close to the team. So yeah, I've spent 80% of my time since I'm in Italy with them, um, working on the simulator. Uh, even when I'm, I'm, I am at home, I'm doing my sim. So yes, I, I spend quite a lot of time focusing on, on doing sim in the tracks that I'm going to race this season. For sure, eating uh, healthy foods because it's important, it's like the fuel for our body. And uh, for sure working out quite a lot because we know that F3, is, is, it starts to become very, very tough. Not, not as, as close as Formula One, but still you need to be strong and well prepared. Who is your idol when, as a child? I, I would say um, Ayrton Senna is Brazilian and he did history in F1. If you have to give an, an advice to a really, really young uh, guy who is starting uh, going with a card, which, uh, which would be? I would say work hard, uh, chase your dreams, because if I throw, I remember like if, I, if it's, it was yesterday, you know, I was in karting, but it was already four or five years ago. So times go very fast. And I would say give your best every moment of your career. That for sure you will have an opportunity to be in a good team in the formulas and uh, or whatever you want to do. Okay, now I think I can, we can go to have a quick look to the paddle. What do you think? Yeah, sure. Let's have a look. Let's go. about the helmet? Yeah, it's uh, still a helmet painted by Infinity. It's a Brazilian uh, painter. It's very special to me. There is the Brazilian flag here and also the Italian flag behind where there is my surname, Bortoleto, that I'm uh, part of Italian family as well, my grandmother. Uh, and yes, it's very special to me. I have this, I would say these three wings. I, this is the thing that I used since I was very, very small and I began on karting and it's a very special layout this year for me. It comes a bit of everything that I've made until now. Great. It's a mix of everything. How, how, long, how long have you been in Italy now? Eight years. Eight years, cool. So you speak Italian as well? Yes, perfect. Okay. Perfect. <laughs> okay, here there is all the cars uh, in the right side. Uh, in your right side, my left side, there is my car. Here is Oliver car and Forna car. 
So yeah, here is where all the mechanics do all the mega job for us to be uh, as ready as possible to make the best laps as possible, I would say. And yeah, here there is the part of uh, that all the engineers, we do the meetings and stuff. This is not the proper um, building that we use in all the European races because we use the truck. But when we race outside of Europe, we use this side that is a, it's a tent, a big tent. That uh, it's a, a lot smaller than what we are used to. But for example, in Bahrain, we are using like this. Here there is all the engineers and data stuff, all the information that they need when we are running. Here is a fridge that the drivers cannot take because it's, uh, it's not healthy. <laughs> stuff to eat. Here there's the lockers to put our stuff, racing stuff, everything. The flag of Brazil is everywhere. Yeah, everywhere. My home country, very important to me. I would say thank you very much for watching. Thank you very much for following this tour. Um, I hope to see you guys soon and make another one of this. Thank you very much, everyone. Peace, and that's it.